so hey guys welcome back in Korea Bangla YT and in this video uh, as you can see there's a comment request or you know a requested video that uh, I an idea for your video how to make a auto run like PUBG mobile or C, uh, CODM so Call of Duty mobile okay the short pitch of uh, Call, uh, Call of Duty mobile is CDO or COD or CDOM however he tell me like that the auto run the auto run is kind of like a endless running type game that uh, just think that you are playing the game okay let me first of all set up my AG quality okay so as you can see this is a basically run okay but we know what he want that when we run like automatically like we just set like this and it will be automatically running okay it's kind of like a uh, you know it's all the same feature have in Call of Duty Mobile and PUBG Mobile so let's create but in our case we'll be use a button for now okay because I don't have that components or that plugin so that plugin is paid so sorry for that however let's start so at player uh, at design I already add a button okay so we will be use this button for auto run so let's give it tags at here and let's set the front size to 12 SP I think that is be work at here or we can set it to 10 SP okay now what will we do here write that a u t o auto run okay it's not important that uh, you are writing or not okay I'm just right here for understand okay however that is the auto run we all I already set the gravity to left side so then go to at on click so at is the on click I already create a class that get all actor from class I'm just getting my this pair reference on my UI by this code that get all actor from class then get a copy then get set the reference at this variable okay now I just get the uh, variable you can call this variable uh, the player reference however now at our player uh, BP you find this code that add movement inputs and get forward vector and the first person camera so from this one we want that it automatically run so make sure the value should be 1 okay don't set it to 0 or plus 10 or something like that you need to set it to 1 by default 1 is the go forward uh, the plus is always go you know forward and the minus go backward maybe the back I don't know however plus now we need to create that a custom event you can use the uh, the event tick like m let me show you like uh, tick event tick as you can see this tick at here so we'll be grab them and where is our code um, where where here okay so we'll be get our event tick and connect it with this okay so now it will be automatically run let me show you that if I connect it with like this as you can see it's automatically running however we need a command that uh, when we press this button it will be only work on that time not uh, always okay so for do that what will we do at here that simply create a boolean okay so this boolean will be help you to verify this so we can call this that auto uh, run okay I'm just calling this that auto run so okay that is the boolean now search get this thing and search that if and else and with even tick will be connected with this thing like that and it's true so we can run auto so now you have a question that bro how you can set up this thing uh, how we can control this a uh, boolean from our UI that is very easy you need to create a custom uh, you know a function or custom block that custom custom event custom event that auto oh, sorry auto run Ah, sorry this events or uh, this variables also have the same name that's why right. auto uh, hey you to auto r u n run us ah, what the suck it is auto run c m d okay i'm just calling this the auto run c m d so in auto run c m d i will be use a flip and flop okay this flip and flop help you to when we press one time this should be enable our auto run boolean so we'll be just click on set that true and if it's for a second time click will be set it to that it will be should be false okay so at the b it should be false so now our auto run will be work so now we can call this function in our ui because we already using the reference of our player so now we can search that auto run cmd so just connect it with like that okay now if I hit the compile and now if I play play as you can see it's not running automatically okay but now if I press on auto run 
as you can see it's auto running okay but if i again press this thing it it will be stop okay so guys that is the code for auto run like pubg system you can use some components in pubg available uh sorry pubg available in our unreal engine marketplaces that when you drag with this it will be execute this button so there's a paid plugin so i don't have money so sorry for that uh, but you can use like that when you press the button it will be auto run okay so i just hope you like this video don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel Cody Mangla YT. and if you have any type of request you can comment us in my comment box because i always give the reply you can check my any of comment uh any of my comment i will give reply okay there's if you ask me anything i must reply okay so thank you so much for watching guys love you all and bye bye